explain yourself. So we were parked on this wonderful place. Mina's favorite place so far. But tomorrow we have to upload a video. So uh, we needed to drive. Now we've been driving for about 20 minutes and there's still no internet. We were thinking that we would go there as well, but as the whole region is a bit of a corona nest, then we do not want to go there nor get stuck there. It's a real pity we can't visit that island, like it looks so gorgeous. It's 10 minutes until the curfew, so we have to hurry. I really hope everything goes well. Alrighty, now we're gonna go and grab some water, load ourselves up again, and uh, hopefully we can get into Methana. It's right over there. And it's a region of Greece with a lot of volcanoes. There's a good reminder from the water tap. Drink water, guys. This road that we're driving on, it actually used to be ocean back in the day, but one of the many eruptions that happened here on Methana just brought up a little bit of land, and now this it has such a land bridge. the other, other caves we've been this one does not invite to go swimming to be honest there's some kind of stuff on the water it is quite a climb to get here and uh, those rocks here make you a bit timid I mean I just said that a small little earthquake and it's a volcanic volcanic uh, region so there can be earthquakes anytime and this whole thing could be just coming down. What's our next stop, Mina? A volcano. A volcano? Is it active? No, it's a sleeping beauty. I bloody love volcanoes. I forgot my hat. Have you ever been inside a volcano before? <laughs> Surreal, like a different world. It's weird volcanic rock, they're really light. Explain yourself. I dropped the GoPro. So he dropped the gro GoPro on a volcanic ground where there are holes everywhere. We were really, really, really lucky. <laughs> Do 
there must have been some kind of fumes in that, that, that crater over there. So this is the part of the volcanoes I also love. There's natural hot pools and here they made it with a pump. So we turned it on from here. And now it's pumping warm water into the bathtub. Pretty damn cool. <laughs> okay, it's not hot. <laughs> I don't know why they call them the hot pools. <laughs> it's not even warm. <laughs> it's fucking cold in here. The view on the back is pretty good though. No, it's an Instagram place. It's, <laughs> it's nothing more. It's an Instagram place. When you film it, it's terrible. It might be better in the summer so you can cool down. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking thermal paths. Fuck it off. We're gonna leave now. spend a lot of time in here. We did that. And we also want to get out of Attica, the capital territory. So we try to do it today just to be on a safe side. So we managed to sneak out of Attica yesterday and today we are in the ancient town of Epitaurus. Epitaurus. It was actually a sanctuary back in the day, like a healing place. Another thing in here is a amphitheater. It's one of the best preserved ones and uh, it's in, huge. in its uh, best days it seated 14,000 people. So at the moment it seems that the whole place is shut down. Another closed gate. Since all the gates are closed, we'll try to get as close to the theater as possible. Maybe we can sit it somewhere over the fence. I think we're on private land now. I think. <laughs> so it's just behind those bushes. Well, we can see a corner of it. They're doing a good job hiding a big theater into the bushes. We got a glimpse from a drone and uh, now we're gonna just circle the whole place and see if we can see any ruins as well from the old sanctuary. We're not gonna go in, nah. How did you get in there? Well, we didn't exactly get the huge 
cultural experience out of here but we did manage to walk four kilometers around the perimeter of the of the fence and just when we finished here a police officer came to a uh, there's like a booth over there that says police under and all the locals that were parked up here just disappeared so uh, we will disappear as well it's getting quite annoying how google keeps offering us uh, faster routes so annoying google stop doing that stop offering us better choices but yeah well we're gonna go through mountains somewhere and use little small roads to avoid big road stops. I'm, I'm not even sure if they exist, but we've been using small roads and we haven't had any trouble lately with the police. Ancient town of Mycenae, I think that's how it's pronounced in English. In Greek it should be Mykenes. Sadly it's closed, we can't go there, there's an awesome museum over there, but what makes it special that is that uh, it's been habited for thousands and thousands of years and thanks to the importance of this town, the whole period in uh, Greek uh, history is named actually after this place, the Mycenaean Age. that we've been told to uh, leave a place and bring the drone down so now we're moving on and hopefully we'll make it to uh, Corinth by the, by the evening it looks like a, like a place where we're gonna be homeless in a few minutes <laughs> Joe is putting up the drone from here and I'm gonna go to the footbridge and show you what I can see from there. The whole place is an absolute dump. <laughs> it's, it's definitely not what we expected the canal to look like. When it comes to the channel of Corinth, it's been a dream for many rulers over thousands of years to make this happen. Like a trade route. <laughs> but it was only finished in uh, the late 1800s. And as a funny ending to the story, pretty much all the cargo ships nowadays are wider than the channel. The channel at the base is a bit over 20 meters and uh, so now that this dream has come true it's more of a tourist attraction than a trade route we are in Nemea Wineland that was a vineyard and before there were almonds Joe told me to bring the camera inside when I talk was that inside enough? I hope so, otherwise this happens. Our problem is a bit that we have both worked in the vineyard when we were in New Zealand um, a bit more than a year ago and not feeling nostalgic. Not feeling nostalgic at all. It's, it feels nice to be driving away from them. Ha <laughs> ha! 